welcome back to my channel. In today's video, as you may have noticed from the title, we are tackling a lot of things on the to-do list. We are going to clean, organize, decorate, and then host at the very end. So I'm so excited you're here and I hope it gives you all the motivation to do all the things today. Throughout this video, I'm going to be jumping all over the place cleaning different things. This isn't exactly a cleaning routine, but this is some things that I do right before we're hosting every single time. So since we were going to be eating at the dining room table, I wiped down the table so that I could vacuum up any crumbs that might come off of it. I shared this on my Instagram story not too long ago, but lately this summer we've been having a lot of, I think they're called mayflies, they're really, really small bugs, and they somehow get in, even if we keep our screens closed and do our best, and they are all over the pine floor. I know it's hard to see in this video, but just so you know, hundreds of little bugs are all over the place. Next, I needed to tidy up the laundry room so I could use it as my cleaning base camp and have all my products just sitting on top of the machines while I was working through the clean. So I just put away the laundry and then got out the ironing board to get the table linens ready. So I needed to iron the runner and some napkins for the evening. Let me know in the comments below, do you prefer cloth napkins or paper napkins? I was never into cloth napkins, but in the last couple years, I've become obsessed. They're so much better for the environment and they just feel amazing and make your tablescape look that much more put together, I think. This time, my boyfriend got home with groceries, so I needed to unpack those and sort out the fridge a little bit. This is mostly stuff for the cheese board that I'm gonna make later, but I just needed to organize it, wash some produce, and all of that. And we don't like using plastic bags either, but let me know if your local grocery store is still banning reusable bags. For us, that was a weird rule that came out through all of this COVID stuff. I don't completely understand it, but it's plastic bags from as far as we know. The kitchen was 
fairly clean. I just needed to really wipe the surfaces just to get everything sparkling and nice. And my stainless steel tends to get finger marks almost daily, so I really needed to tackle that before we had people over. I found out this little tip or trick not too long ago, but if you are worried that your stainless steel looks streaky after you use your stainless steel cleaner, just wait 10 minutes. It's all those streaks, they tend to disappear after 10 minutes. I'm not sure why, but I've gone crazy just rubbing and rubbing thinking, oh, it's still streaky, but leave it 10 minutes, come back, and then let me know if there are streaks. I'm so excited I finally found some pompous grass at my local Michaels so I was able to set that up in this pot I'm still not sold that this is the right pot for the pompous grass but because it's so summery I thought it worked for now I think maybe a concrete one with a smaller top opening would work a little bit better but let me know what you think should I be buying more grasses for this pot in particular or should I just be looking for a different pot right off the bat. I've been deep down stuck in the gutter. I've been off the grid for days. I've been lost just trying to forget her. But I wake up and nothing's changed. I've been gone down lost in the letters. Trying to get back into place. I've been losing ground in the lost and found Cause I let it slip away Now time for a quick daily tidy of the bathroom. I just wanted to wipe down the counters, mirror, and do the toilet just to make everything nice and fresh. And this freedom just left me haunted And all my reasons start to fade Cause I thought it wasn't worth it Yeah, I thought it was too late I was so burned out trying to ease my mind like there was nothing left For products in the bathroom, I'm using basically all Miss Myers. I'm using the tub and tile for the sink and for the counters and then for the mirror, I'm just using the Myers glass cleaner. Then I also use the all-purpose cleaner for the counters as well and I know that might be a little bit overkill but that's all we're doing in here and we also have our Myers hand soap in here as well which I love I think this scent is the basil or basil mint and it smells amazing for summer but I go too far in my house of cards Every morning it's the same I'll see it now ooh, 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 ooh. I can't sleep by 
Okay, it's time to vacuum up the entire master area, the closet, the bathroom, the bedroom, and then move on into the main living room once again to vacuum out there. Now something's missing, love You're the reason, you're the reason, oh To keep it up for love Cause you're the reason for these pieces Maybe someday I'll give up But I can't move on, you're never gone, no the rest of the kitchen but I realized I should probably do this first I went to the dollar store to get a couple things to help us with our tiny like cereal cover situation because it's so messy I can't find anything so I think I'll be able to fit a basket in a couple of these cereal containers so I want to wash these out empty up the cover Make sure I vacuum that so nothing falls on the floor and then see if it works. It might be phase one of trying to organize it, but I'll show you the before and after because it's pretty bad. Although it wasn't the perfect organized, it was really, really quick, it's already functioning a lot better. And look at how many cereal boxes we were able to recycle just by combining them into the plastic containers and just getting rid of all the empties. I should be the last to know. Now it's time for one of my favorite household chores, if you want to call it a chore, but it's creating the tablescape for our dinner guests. So I got this runner just at Michael's and I've had it for a while. These placemats are just from Amazon and then I'm using some wood cutting boards and cheese boards to line the entire middle. I also went to Michael's to get this garland the day I filmed this and I'm going to reuse it definitely on our fireplace for Easter next year and any sort of spring or summer decor, but I love it. It's very, very simple and it looks real, but it's not um, fabric. It's plastic, so if there were any food or items to get onto it, we could easily wipe it. And then I'm just using these wood coasters and different sized candles, also from Michael's, to kind of layer and create the ambiance for the night. I should be the last to know
Whenever we have guests over, I always like to have an element of freshness. So fresh flowers it is. This time I'm not going to be putting them on the table since it's going to be quite full with the cheese board and everything. So I'm just going to leave it on the counter and I usually light a candle beside it. Always find your way to higher ground May you always keep your head held up high Pretty little thing You're a diamond in the rough Shining from within I can tell that you're tough Just the sight of you when I'm at my weakest point just taking a quick break from inside and heading out to the car to unload from the garden center earlier in the day. And my boyfriend is going to plant some of the perennials I got. I just got a couple things because I noticed our gardens are quite green in July. So I found hydrangeas, some lavender, and then a couple other plants, but I'm no gardener, so I can't even remember the names. I can tell that you're tough. Order in a cup of love, feel it rising up and above. You will always keep my heart and soul. In the guest bathroom now, I am doing a good clean, especially of our bathtub, although no one will be taking a bath. You can definitely see all the sparkles from a bath bomb I used last week, so I wanted to make sure I scrubbed that down and made everything nice and shiny. And last week I did film a video entirely in this bathroom and it is called how to clean your bathroom with one product. So if you're interested in knowing what product that was, head on over to that video. I'll leave it linked below and I was blown away. And no, I am not using that product in this video. So you'll have to go there to see what you think the product is. Feel it rising up and above You will always keep my heart and soul strong Plant your seeds and watch them grow The light will always know where to go You will always keep my heart and soul strong First thing in the morning and the last Baby, you're my future and you are my past Pretty little thing You're a diamond in the rough Shining from within I can tell that you're tough Order in a cup of love Feel it rising up and above you will always keep my heart and soul strong Plant your seeds and watch them grow The light will always know where to go You will always keep my heart and soul strong Love the smell coastal sun fun tip if you are hosting um, light it an hour before and the whole room smells so good and here is the tablescape for tonight we're just doing appetizers so I also lit these candles early as well just so that they get the nice dripping effect while we're eating and I just took out the chilled wine and made some soda water and I have flat water in the fridge I'm gonna put out and I'm gonna start doing this cheese board now.
that is everything for today's video. Thank you so much for coming along and cleaning and organizing and decorating and getting ready to host with me. I hope you have a beautiful day ahead of you and I will see you in my next video. Never.